And now for our final performer of the evening and our very special honored guest, fresh from a performance at Hard House at the University of Toronto, an interview with George Strombolopoulos, and this afternoon, a performance with BAM, <laughs> the Toronto Youth Slam team at the Williamsford Mill, the legendary John Giorno, joining us on his 75th birthday tour. He's almost here. An innovator of poetry and performance, his career spanning 50 years is intertwined with contemporaries like Andy Warhol and William S. Burroughs. John helped pioneer the open exploration and celebration of queer sexuality and poetry in the 1960s. His anti-war work with Abby Hoffman resulted in Spiro Agnew labeling him one of the Hanoi Hannas in the 1970s. <laughs> And his AIDS treatment project, be begun in 1984, set the bar for direct, compassionate action in the AIDS crisis. He founded Giorno Poetry Systems in 1965 to explore the use of technology and poetry, working with electronic and multimedia. In 2010, John had his first one-person gallery show in New York entitled Black Paintings and Drawings at Nicole Clagsburn Gallery, wherein he exhibited works that chronicled the evolution of poem painting. Long before the internet and social networking, his Dial a Poem of 1968 at the Museum of Modern Art in New York made contemporary poetry available over the phone to millions of people. A practicing Buddhist since the early 1970s, John has been an important force in the development of Buddhism in North America and in the ongoing conversation between Buddhist and poetic practice. Join, John is the author of many books of poetry, has been the subject of films and many other things we don't have time to mention tonight. Let's welcome John Giorno. Woo! 